Hey guys, remember the catalyst right now for stocks are earnings reports, especially with the AI stocks. We're seeing obviously any company that beats earnings and raise guidance, they're getting rewarded and they're going up nicely like Palantir, like Arm Holdings, okay? But just know once we clear through earnings season, I think that's when we're gonna get a healthy correction. And Nvidia's earnings, this is gonna be big guys. So they, their earnings are on February 21st. And I was looking back at last year's earnings report. Remember, you always wanna look at year over year comparisons. They reported uh, six, just over six billion in revenue. So I do think this report could still show stellar growth, okay? With comparing over to last year because their last quarter results were at like 18 billion. And obviously this one should be higher than that even, we'll see, but that's still gonna show really nice growth. The, the question is, is that priced into the stock right now? We get a sell the news event. That's anyone's guess, right? Obviously after a stellar rally, we could see that. But as you know, I like NVIDIA long. If you already bought this, hopefully you want to recommend it at back, you know, in the 400s, you're just holding, you know, and, and don't touch those shares, put that in your retirement. Hopefully it's in your long-term portfolio where you're not going to touch it. But that year over year comparison with the 6 billion, right? Should beat nicely. And then the next report after that, I was looking from, and that was what, uh, April or May of 2023. Okay, they did a little over 7 billion in revenue. So that's another report that could beat nicely with earnings, okay? But then after that one, okay, that's where the comparisons are gonna be much more difficult because then it goes up to 13 and a half billion and then to 18 billion. So again, the comparisons are obviously gonna show lower growth, right? You're not gonna see 200% growth when you're working off of large numbers. So that's what I want you to remember down the road. But right now for the next couple quarters, Nvidia could still beat nicely. And we'll see if the stock has legs. I mean, this is one of the best companies in the world. We know people from all over the world are buying it and they have the legit numbers to back it up. There's a lot of other AI companies that it's more hype. The numbers really don't back it up. Like AMD, even though I think they could grow into their valuation right now, a lot of it is just, you know, the stock's been going up because of Nvidia. We saw their earnings and they barely beat expectations. So it's nothing like Nvidia and that, is much more overvalued, you know, AMD. So you have to be selective of which ones you own. Focus on the companies that actually beat earnings and more importantly, raise their guidance, okay? And those are the ones you can, you know, wait for a dip, of course. You never want to buy at the top. That's my motto. Wait for a, a healthy dip on those and then you can enter again if you're a long-term investor.